Good morning. Good morning. What are we going to do today? Well, what I'm thinking about doing is doing a... I got this box to build with minor joints. So we, to strengthen it up, I got an idea uh, of putting a hidden spline in it. Most of the time, most of the time, you, you, when you, they cut the spline, the grain is running this way. But, this, you know, the force is pulling, it's easier to break right here. So what I'm going to try today is I'm going to cut the spline. I'm going to cut here. The grain now be running this way. So with the forces, that's the wood is naturally stronger that way. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna cut these and the splines, like this example right here, in this spline, the, the grain is running this way. So, but when I'm done with this thing, the, the splines will go this way. And I think that's gonna add strength to our joint right here because we're using three quarter inch red oak plywood, but they're going to be paper, stacks of paper and stuff on this, and it's, it's, it's going to have some weight on it. So what I thought about doing, I've never seen this done, and people may do it all the time, but I thought I would try this, and that way I think it'd be a stronger joint. So for, right now I'm going to take my track saw and get a rough cut down to, and then we can start. You just stick with me. What we'll do, uh, I'll show you how I do a spline. What are we getting ready to do? Well, I'm gonna rough cut it with my track saw. So I'm cutting the length now. Uh, I'm cutting it 16 inches. By the time I'm done and got it squared up, it'll be 15 and three quarters. So I'm gonna get this cut and I'll probably cut it to length with this too. It's just easier to do here. At some point, I'm gonna have an outfeed table and an infeed table that I just needed to get time to do it. That's another video. Yeah, we can do that. Uh, but I, if I had it set up right with my outfeed, and I'm, these things are hard to be. I just need to take time to do it. Uh, cutting a sheet of plywood on table saw is not a problem. But I'm fortunate enough to have a track saw, so I'm gonna put it to use today. <laughs> see if I can get her. All righty. So here we go. Here we go. So we're ready to lay the splines out uh, with three quarters of an inch material. I always like to put three quarter of an inch splines. Or if you remember, our stock piece is three sixteenths thick. So I like starting right there. So to lay, you just have to lay the first one out. And once you get your saw blade set, um. Uh, you just cut them all then. So I'm looking at three quarters. So, so three eighths, three quarters right there. And we're looking at three sixteenths thick. That'd be right there. So what are you looking at? So 
So what we're looking at, we, we to, to cut right through here, this out. And we use this corner here, the corners to set up the saw blade. <clears throat> So what we do here, we use two Okay. See where he's gonna be. And then we'll bump the fence over when the time comes to make it fit what we'll do we'll take this right here when it fits in there correctly is what we're going to wind up doing so i'm going to run it bevel along through here what we'll do we'll give it we'll sneak up on the you know we'll, you know, we'll sneak up on the, the depth Increase until we got it there. Now we'll cut all the other corners of that right there. Then we'll make
And the thing about it, you got to put the glue on it where you want it to go. You can't count on it going there on its own. I think maybe what? I think maybe I should move this other board. Maybe. Papa. Yeah. Grumpy. <laughs> They'd be the outtakes. This would be the way everybody thinks it's fun. Oh, yeah. Grumpy. We'll have a bunch of outtakes. You only threw what? Threw, th th threw two or three things at me? No, I never thrown nothing at you. But he wanted to. He just won't admit it. If, I... if tools didn't cost so much, I'd throw them. But they cost so much, you can't afford to throw them. <laughs> Sometimes it's just better to go watch TV. Yeah, I'll just step back away for a minute. But I think that, that you're going to have a stronger joint right there with the grain running the direction you need it to. Uh, and it ain't, you get it right, it ain't much harder to do it that way. And I think you're going to have a much stronger joint. One of these days, we'll do a test. Test? I see them test all the time. But I've never seen anybody do it with the long brain running the direction that I've got it. That'd be... Kind of strong, it, you know it, it would have to be stronger. Because the wood's stronger than that one. This is a... Uh-oh. Boo-boo. Boo-boo. Uh-oh. That sounds to me like a January project. Cold and dreary day, no presents to make, nothing to do. We'll do it. That's the thing right now. There's always something to do. Okay, say bye. Well, bye. Say. Y'all comment, like, and subscribe to me. Well, no, we gotta take it out of the clamps tomorrow. We ain't done videoing. Okay. This is well, we, we can still say you know, like, subscribe, and leave a comment. Leave a comment if if I'm not going in detail enough or I'm going in detail too much. Just uh, just let me know. Uh, I can go do it either way. We can go in more detail or we can back off and put it to music and skim across everything. But I don't know. If someone learning, you kind of want the details. Y'all just let me know. Say bye. Bye.